Kyrie, obviously a chance to close it out tonight at home. Just what stands out from a loss like this in your opinion? Um, sure. Uh, what stands out is, is just our, our competitive spirit, uh, you know, especially throughout the game. Um, you know, that first quarter, we only scored 20 points, um, gave up 27. Uh, it's not, it's uncharacteristic, like for us to kind of be in that, that type of battle in the first quarter, we usually like to keep the, uh, the game pretty close, even though, you know, later in the game, we, we caught up, but how I started off in particular, the game with a few turnovers and, you know, if I'm setting an example like that, then other guys are going to follow suit, unfortunately at times. And, you know, it just leads to just that lack of days play. So that's on me taking the accountability. I got to start off the game a lot better and, um, just get a shot up at the rim instead of turning the ball over. So I think, you know, starting off the game, uh, we just weren't in a great rhythm as of yet. We picked it up in the uh, second half a little bit more. Um, but yeah, just a few costly turnovers and, um, you know, some miscommunications on the defensive end uh, during some crucial times in the game. Um, felt like that was the difference tonight, you know. Kyrie, is, um, you know, with, with obviously the chance to close out the this, this series, uh, you know, how much... Is there disappointment? Is that the right emotion to take from a game like this, disappointment? Yeah, we're human. I mean, you know, we go out there and try to win. So, um, you know, we come in here with the right mentality, right preparation. We feel like we put ourselves in a great position to win the basketball game. We, we obviously fell short. We failed at that. Um, but there are still some positives that we can take moving forward. Um, you know, and like I said to the, to the previous question, just a, a few uh timely shots that they hit in that fourth quarter and that third quarter where it was a miscommunication. Um, you know, we just got to be better. And um, a few breakdowns in that first half too, Mike Conley getting to the rim for open layups and just breakdowns happening. And, um, you know, the game is within balance and we're trying to break the lead open a little bit more. We got to do it, um, you know, how we've been doing it majority of the second half of the season, that's on the defensive end. You know, the offensive end is going to take care of itself at times. We're going to make or miss shots, but defensively, that's where we have to, uh, make our presence be felt. Um, and I think it also starts uh, in terms of matching their physicality or overpowering their physicality in the beginning of the game. It was a very physical game. Calls were going back and forth. Uh, so, yeah, there is a level of disappointment. That's a human emotion, um, but also uh, just a natural reflection of just how we can play better moving forward and just, you know, wash our hands with this one. They got a win. Uh, they're a great team. I've been saying it all series. So, uh, we expect them to do the same thing when in Minnesota, just coming out with that physicality, playing to their home crowd and uh, making things difficult on me and Luca.